Hello and welcome to the first ODI between India and South Africa. During the India's visit of South Africa, this is going to be three ODIs series. South Africa have won the toss and elected to bat first. On India's side, Venkatesh Ayer is going to be debut. And Virat Kohli is going to play under the captaincy of Rahul. So firstly, India's team is going to be Rahul captain, Dhawan, then Kohli, Shiryas Ayer, Rishwa Pant, Venkatesh Ayer, Ashwin, Shadul Thakur, Bhavi Kumar, Jasprit Bumrah and Chahal. And looking at the playing 11 of South Africa is going to be the Cock, Malan, Mokarram, Vander Dusen, Bevuma, the captain, David Miller, Felicu, Jensen, Maharaj, Shamsi and Nagiri. The Cock and Malan are the openers and they are ready to play and the first over is being bowled by Bumrah. The third ball of the over this time Bumrah to D Cock and it's a delivery going on the leg side which has clipped the the pad of the batsman and gone past the wicket keeper for four run. First boundary of leg by. Fifth ball of the third over this time Bumrah to D Cock and this is a beautiful cover drive by D Cock and it's gone through to the cover boundary for four runs. The first ball of the fourth over, Bhavi to Mallon, and Mallon played it towards the backward point where the fielder missed field and it's gone through his legs for four runs. Second ball of the fifth over, this time Bumrah to Mallon, and it's the ball swinging away, and Mallon wanted to play a hang his bat on and has taken the edge straight to the wicket keeper. The first man of South Africa is gone. David Mallon is gone for six. Last ball of the over, this time to Beverman. This is half volley, and Beverman leans onto it and Punches it through the cover for four runs. First ball of the 11th over this time. Taco to Decock. Full on the wide and wide out on the offside. And Decock plays it nicely through the cover. And that's gone for four runs. First ball of the 16th over this time. Ashwin to Decock. And it's ball which has skidded through. And Ashwin has scored the wicket of Decock who wanted to play. And his off stump is gone off. And that's the big wicket for India. South Africa lost a second wicket. D Cork is gone for 27. Last ball of the over to Bevoma is a tossed up ball and Bevoma coming out and driving it through the cover nicely for four runs. Fourth ball of 18th over this time Ashwin to Mukharram. It's a tossed up ball on the stumps and Mukharram pushes it towards uh, the mid off and sets off for a single and there's a direct hit on the bowler's end and Mukharram is gone. He's been run out on four. Third ball of 19th over this time, Chahal to Vendor Dusen and Dusen reverse sweeps it nicely and there has been a bit of fubbly, fubble at the, by the fielder and that's gone to the boundary row for four runs. At the end of 20 over, South Africa 80 for 3, India in well control at this stage. Fifth ball of 21st over this time, Chahal to Vendor Dusen and he gets out and sweeps it through mid-wicket for which races to the boundary rope. Third ball of 23rd over this time, Chahal to Dusen again and... Dusen sweeps it again through the cow corner and that's gone to the boundary rope. First ball of 24th over this time, Taku to Dusen and it's a full toss and Dusen comes down and clubs it over long on for maximum, first maximum of the match. Second ball of 25th over this time, Chahal to Bevuma and Bevuma this time sweeps it through nicely and it's gone to the boundary rope. And fifth ball this time is fly to Bevuma and Bevuma crunches it through the extra cover and that's gone again to the boundary rope. Last ball of 28th over on the leg side and Dusen glances it and is gone past the wicket keeper for four runs. Fourth ball of 29th over this time Bumrah to Bevoma. Bevoma wanted to play and is taken the edge, gone over the wicket keeper's head for four runs. Fifth ball of 30th over this time Chahal to Bevoma and Bevoma pedal sweeps it and is gone down the fine leg for four runs. Fourth ball of 35th over this time Bhavi to Bevoma. Short ball and Bevoma pulls it through mid-wicket boundary for four runs. Second ball of 37th over this time. Bumrah to Dusan. Short ball on the off stump. And Dusan cuts it beautifully wide of the third man for four runs. Fourth ball of the 40th over. Ashwin to Dusan. It's a quicker ball on the off stump. And Ashwin uh, and Dusan cuts this ball of Ashwin. It's gone all the way to the boundary rope for four. Fifth ball of 45th over this time, Taku to Dusen, and that's a powerful shot which went past the fielder Virat Kohli and that's gone to the boundary row for four. 
Fifth ball of 46 over this time, Bhavi to Bevoma. And Bevoma wanted to play. It's taken the edge over the wicket keeper's head and it's gone for four runs. At the end of 47 over South Africa, 259 for three. Dusan no total 98, 99 and Bevoma on 108. And the very first ball of 48th over by Bhavi to Dusan, which has been flicked through leg side and he takes a single and completes his 100. Fifth ball of the 40th over this time, Bhavi to Dusan and it's a full toss and he punishes it over the square leg for six. First ball of 49th over this time, Bumra to Bevoma and Bevoma has played it and it's gone straight to the fielder Rahul who takes the catch on long gone and that's the end of Bevoma. 110 is gone and the opening the stand for between these two has been 204. Third ball of the last over this time Taku to Dusan and Dusan punishes this one very nicely over the core corner for another maximum. What a great shot. Second last ball of the innings this time of the innings and this is a low full toss and this time Dusan plays it very nicely through the gap again through the core corner and that's gone for four runs. And that's the end of and the single on the last ball and that brings the end of South Africa innings. 296 for four. India needed 297 runs to win the match. Leave your comments. What do you think? Who is going to be the key player from India side for the win? Or from South Africa bowling attack? Hello and welcome to the second part of the first ODI between India and South Africa. Earlier... South Africa batted first and made 296 for four in the 50 overs and India has scored the target of 297 to win the match. Both Indian openers are ready to start the match and I'm going to bring you the highlights of the match. Fifth ball of the second over, Jensen to Dhawan, tight line on and is taken the inside edge, lucky for Dhawan, is gone past the leg stump for four runs. Third ball of the fourth over, this time Jensen to Dhawan and this time Dhawan comes forward on the front foot and punches it nicely and that's gone to the fence. Fourth ball of the fifth over, this time Mokaram to Dhawan and Dhawan comes down the track and aggressively hits it over mid on for four runs. Fourth ball of the sixth over, this time Jensen to Dhawan is a full and straight and Dhawan whips it off the pads and that's gone to the mid wicket boundary for four runs. Third ball of the eighth over this time Jensen to Dhawan and it's a short ball and Dhawan pulls it and it's gone to the square leg boundary for four. The fifth ball this is even shorter and Dhawan gets on top of it and cuts it over the cover for four runs. Third ball of the ninth over this time Mukharam to Rahul and it's outside the off and short ball and length ball and they wanted to defend it and it's taken the edge straight to the wicket keeper at the first wicket fall Rahul is gone for 12. Fifth ball of the ninth over this time Mukharam to Kohli and it's a short ball and Kohli plays it nicely towards the square leg boundary for four runs. First ball of the tenth over Maharaj to Dhawan going down the leg side and Dhawan helps it and slaps it down and it's gone to the boundary for four runs. Last ball of twelfth over this time Maharaj to Dhawan and that's a lucky outside edge and it's gone through the slips for four runs. Lucky for Dhawan, lucky for India and four runs comes in. Fourth ball of 17th over Nagedi to Kohli and this time he plays a beautiful shot through the mid wicket and that's gone for four runs. Second ball of 19th over this time Nagedi to Dhawan and this is a beautiful cover drive by Dhawan and it's gone to the boundary rope. Fourth ball of 21st over this time Shamsi to Dhawan and Dhawan went for sweep and it's taken the top edge and gone all the way to the boundary rope for four runs. Second ball of 25th over this time Shamsi to Kohli and Sh Kohli has nicely played the Rishti short towards the fine leg boundary, square leg boundary for four runs. Third ball of 26th over this time Maharaj to Dhawan and this is a beautiful ball which turns in from off to off and beats Dhawan and rattles his stumps and that's the big wicket. Dhawan is gone for 79, clean bolt. India 138 for two. Fourth ball of the 28th over Maharaj to Kohli Full on the pads and Kohli flicks it towards the backward square leg and take one run and that brings his 50. Another 50 from Kohli. Second ball of 29th over this time Shamsi to Kohli and Kohli wanted to play. He's taken the top edge and going to the mid wicket where Bevaman takes the catch and Kohli's gone for 51. The big wicket fall. 
First ball of 30 second over this time. Jensen to Pant and Pant stands tall and drives it straight back to the bowler for four runs. Fourth ball of 33rd over this time. Paul Kier to Shiryas Iyer and Iyer flicks it nicely towards the short fine leg for four runs. Fifth ball of 34th over this time. Nagidi to Shiryas Iyer. Short ball and he wanted to play it. Taking the edge to the wicket keeper. And that's the end for Iyer. He's gone for 17. First ball of 35th over this time. Paul Kier to Pant and it's going down the leg side and a wide ball and Pant wanted to come forward and play and P wicket keeper the cock has taken the bales off and he's been stumped out. Big wicket. Pant is gone for 16. Fifth ball of 36th over this time Nagidi to Venkrish Iyer and short ball and he wanted to pull it and it's got straight to the fielder at the square, deep square leg who takes the catch and another wicket fall and India is in trouble now. Last ball of 38th over this time Nagidi to Thakur and Thakur clips the ball going down the leg side and scone uh, to the leg side boundary for four. Third ball of 39th over this time Paul Q to Ashwin and it's a low bouncer and Ashwin wanted to play on top of that and stick on the inside bottom edge straight to the wicket and Ashwin is gone for seven. India's batting line is really tumbling down today despite having a fantastic start. First ball of 41st over, Pelkia to Thakur going down the leg side and he clips it and it's gone to the final leg for four. And on the fourth ball this time, Thakur to Thakur is a half volley and Thakur punishes it through the cover. And that's a beautiful drive gone for four runs. Second ball of 43rd over this time, Shamsi to Bhavi and Bhavi this time just chips it towards the fielder where Bhavama takes the catch and that's the end of Bhavi for four. First ball of 46th over this time, Jensen to Bivoma and that's the top edge and gone to the deep fine leg for four runs. This time third ball of 48th over Nagidi to Thakur and this time he has put it away nicely through the extra cover for four runs. Very next ball and this time Thakur wanted to play, he's taken the outside edge and gone past the wicket keeper, another boundary. And the very next ball of Nagidi to Thakur is in the slot and Thakur smashes it over square leg for maximum, what a good shot. At the end of 48 overs, India 254 for 8. Still need 43 runs in 2 overs. And the last ball of the innings, Nagidi to Thakur and he plays the full toss over cover and runs for single and that brings his 50. And he is not out on 50, India 265 for 8 and South Africa have won this match comfortably by 31 runs. South Africa have been in control since they got the second wicket of India and their bowling attack has proved that they, de they deserve this victory. So in this 265, the key part, key players has been Dhawan 79, Kohli 51 and Thakur 50. And from the bowling side, South African side, Nagidi took two wickets, Shamsi took two and Palkia took two. So leave your comments about how you are thinking this 3 ODI series will end. And please subscribe the channel if you have not so far. And do like, share and comment on the video. Thank you.